So in my last video, I talked about this book called Healing Days and how it was pretty much a comprehensive resource for children and adults who have experienced trauma. Now, of course, kids who have experienced trauma have really taken the brunt of the disadvantage. However, the reason that I recommend this book also for adults, especially if you are taking care of someone who has been through some traumatic experiences or if you're a teacher or a counselor or anything like that, this is really helpful guide for you. So I started thinking to myself, what resources would make it easier on me to receive a child who is going to be displaying behaviors because of a known traumatic event? Now keep in mind, not everyone is going to be so willing to be forthcoming about some of the events that their children have experienced. So I created a resource that could either work for a grown up to kind of give teachers and caregivers a heads up about what's going on, or it can be done therapeutically with a child. Part of the book talks about making a safety plan and a feel good plan. So I converted those ideas into just one simple document. And for the safety plan, people I can talk to, places I can go, phone numbers I can call. A feel good plan is activities I can do, music I love, breathing and movement activities. And then down here is my favorite items and tools. As a teacher, a document like this would be so beneficial for me to help me figure out how I can help a child. And I have a story for you coming up in part three.